We're up in the headwaters of a river catchment here. This is where floods start. So all of the, the heavy rain that we've had over the last few days is making its way into these watercourses and getting down into the lower parts of the river. But we're lucky here that we we're in the otter catchment where we've actually got family group of beavers living on this site and they've created this lovely beaver dam and as you can see a lot of the flow is still coming over it but also we've got a lot of water being pushed out sideways and into the floodplain and you can see where we've built this boardwalk to allow us to access this area now but all this water is now spreading out across this floodplain slowing down dropping out sediment as it goes and the more of these wetlands that we've got in our headwaters the slower the flow coming down into our river catchments and if people are living in floodplains downstream what they need are these wetlands up in the headwaters storing the water and more gradually releasing it. The last thing you want to do up here if you're trying to reduce flooding is to dredge these rivers. If you dredge them and you clean out all the obstructions then the, the water just hurtles down towards the sea in one go after rainfall and that's what causes these huge flood events where people are living in floodplains downstream and the river just hasn't got the space to operate.